well, a whole new series to play with, which is going to be a lot of fun. Uh, let's do the quick map tour to start with. The first thing you're probably going to observe is uh, Industrial Island here, which has got a bit of everything. And if I've forgotten anything, which I don't think I have, um, or if I haven't got the balance quite right, I'll probably uh, use the editor to drop in another bit and piece. Because this is not a series about freight. Uh, I will be delivering some freight earlier, and it will be a mighty, mighty freight line that we set up. Uh, probably going up towards Peninsula, of all places, uh, in order to set up a, uh, uh, a super port and then distribute some freight from there on. But that's not why we're here. I'm doing it largely just so that we've got it, but, uh, but too often I get dragged down a hole of, uh, of just covering freight and nothing else. So all freight is contained on one island only which is going to be exciting. Similarly, uh, I've set up uh, the Mega City One Island here, which will be the only place that uh, I have an airport, apart from one reciprocal area, over on the main part of the map. Now, I'm zoomed out as far as I can, but as you can probably make out, this is only a small map. It, well, it's medium. It's medium. What I wanted to do is pack in as much entertainment as possible within a small area and see if it's possible. Um, there are a lot of cities, uh, and uh, and each of these is rated as medium because the thinking is that they are suburban in nature. So uh, so we've got you know a city here where all the city names are, are broadly themed, um, and uh, that's that will end up being one city. And we've got another one over here, and another one there, and so on, and here, and there, and there, and all all of that, all of that business. Um, so yeah, we're surrounded by water just to uh, just to soften the edges of the map a little. Uh, but, but fundamentally, this is about lots and lots of big, fat, beefy passenger lines and uh, and all the services that run therein. Yeah, I don't know if it'll work either, but you've got to give these things a try. Anyway, I've got uh, a shade under five million in the bank because obviously I'm packing a loan. I love it. It's been a long time since I've had to worry about money uh, in the old fever. Um, so what I really ought to do is set up something that will make me a bit of money to start with. Now, as soon as I start trucks moving stuff around over here, then I'll start making money, but I, I don't want to do that. Um, no, I just want to find... I could, have, I could have done this in advance, but I didn't. No, because you're a fool. Uh, and, and the landscape is such that there are going to be no easy town-to-town -town connections. Uh, this might work, though. A bit of off-city Bongolia... The, uh, the Bannerlord town there, uh, over towards uh, Fantasyland. That could work. Let me just price up a bit of track. Uh, we won't... Yeah, yeah we, we better electrify to start with, because we'll probably need it. Uh, right. 1.2 million. Crow flying it, and that's with a bit of cheeky tunnel in there. We could probably do it for just under a million. But that's... They're far enough apart... That uh, that that should be a, should be a halfway decent earner, but we're gonna we're gonna have to be a little bit careful early on, um, in that uh, I don't want to have to wait too long for things to pay back, um, but a you know a good diesel rail car early on is going to be sufficient to hopefully make a bit of cash. So if I were to stick a station in here, knowing full well that I'll probably be uh, nuking it later. Uh, let's go with that. Let's go with one track, high speed, 120 meter, 200 grand. Uh, I can I can work 200 grand. That's not that's not going to be a problem. Um, now several of you may be going, ah, oh, why don't you start with some buses or something? And I kind of go, well, yeah, yeah, but in town buses. I mean, city to city buses tend to work quite well. And in fact, were I to connect up, ah, uh, you see, that's something to do off camera. I reckon. All right, I'll do one of those as well, uh, just so you can see the format, but I'll do it off camera because it's going to be very tedious to watch. Uh, so uh, let's just... I just, <laughs> just want to find somewhere that I'm happy with. Who builds this thing on a flipping slope, honestly? Yes, I will get some mods that deal with uh, flipping slopes. Some slopey stations, I think, will probably be a good thing later on. There we go, this will do. Yeah, but on it now. Whoa, 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 whoa! Think about which way the trains are going to go. You're not yet at the point where you can just bulldoze trains, uh, bulldoze towns, and there will be a lot of town remodeling that takes place in this. Uh, I guess we're going like that, but that means we are almost certainly going to need some bridge, which is going to increase my costs significantly. Uh, the other alternative would be to go down at the bottom end here. 
you're still going to get the same end effect. You're going to need a, a commuter bus to drive passengers to the station, which is going to that's going to be more expensive. All right, maybe I'm changing my plan. All right, let's have a look at Fantasyland through to. I don't know what I do. I don't even know what I call this. I mean, you've got Gaslands next to Night City, but uh, Gaslands is Mad Max, Night City Cyberpunk, Zerus. I can't even remember where that's from. I added that in to fit the theme. Maybe that's more cyberpunk-ish. Could be. No, I don't think. I don't think this is your. I don't think this is a winner either. Uh, uh, Alpha Complex. Yeah, it's a little. It's a little closer. All right, hang on, hang on. I'm not finished looking. Yeah, I know. This is the kind of riveting nonsense we get up to in the early parts of a season. While I'm trying to figure out anything that I can do without running myself bankrupt. Uh, this is Carpenter Island over. Uh, then you've got the, uh, I, I guess, video games. I guess, and these are slightly disturbed slice of reality. Yeah, see, I, I, I have, I have done some work. Uh, then you've got more fantasy land over here, but it's a slightly twisted fantasy land. That one. Um, hmm. Ah. Hmm. Is this fire? No. Okay. All right. I thought I'd ask. Well, I guess I guess that's not going to work. You know what we could do to start with? What? Trams. Yeah, all right. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll do uh we'll do a, a uh, yeah, we'll do a central. We'll try a hub and spokes tram line and it has to make profit. Because if it doesn't, then we're we're all going to be crying uh quite quickly. Uh yeah, I'm going to regret this, but uh it's an un it, I don't think I've ever started with trams. I mean, don't get me wrong, that doesn't make it any more exciting necessarily, but, uh, you know, it makes me go like, oh, yeah, yeah sure, okay, yeah, all right. Uh, let's make it a 10 metre, it doesn't need to be that long. Stick this in about here, right, yeah, okay, yeah, that's in the centre of town. Or, by which I mean, I say centre of town, uh, that's in, is that in Sunnydale or Twin Peaks? What does it think it is? Sunnydale. Um, and then we'll go out to Pleasantville and Shermer to start with. Yes. Yeah. Shermer's not that twisted a uh, slice of real life. It's John Hughes, man. It's twisted. Um, okay. Let's go for a bit of this. Yeah. 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 I mean, on the plus side, even if this ends up being a bit of a white elephant, uh, it's not going to cost me that much money to set up. I'll still have the train line option. And I think that original one that I was looking at there is probably the best way to go. But hey, die! Ah, you've got to, you've got to once in a while, you know, push it. Now I'm sticking, I'm sticking these termini at each end so that we can turn around relatively easily. Uh, we'll start with, uh, we'll start with the hubs, and then I'll worry about spokes afterwards. Uh, yeah. See, so we'll go bing, bong, bing, bong, bing, bong, bing, like some kind of clock that's not very well tuned. It's not a clock. All right, it's the bell that's associated with the clock. All right, it's... Oh, shut up. Uh, and then we could probably do... We could probably do down here in Erie out to, uh, out to Hill Valley. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go on. You might as well. I mean, if we're committing to this, then commit to it. Fur crying out loud. Right, so we'll sit you in about there. I mean, the, the catchment radius on these isn't going to be stellar, uh, but all of these uh, all of these towns are ripe to grow, particularly where they're connected to one another, uh, because that will improve the mood of the locals to go, oh, our connections are brilliant. You kind of go, you're part of the same metropolis. Huh? See, the, the theme there coming through brilliantly early on. Um, right, let's go for electrical tram tracks. And then, do you want to upgrade the streets at the same time? Well, I'd probably, I'd probably like to do that. Yeah, but we can't move any... See, that's a quarter of a million quid. You can't just throw that away. All right, then we'll, we'll go the ways that it's going to let me go. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you're gonna you're gonna spend you're gonna spend a little bit on this, but it won't be too much as long as you're careful. Uh, yeah, careful's not really something that I'm renowned for, though, is it? Yeah, down there and across here and then over there. One building will be oh well. And if you, come on, you've got to you've got to pause before you press the fire button. Uh, yeah, is that 
Yes, it is. You sure? Well, we'll have another couple of swings at it, I'm sure. So we'll, we'll figure that out. Oh, this is a nice run, this one. Uh, should be relatively simple. But look before you click. Don't just click. For that, that way ends in madness and disaster. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to do this... Uh, this round section here to give people some choices. All right, okay, that's Sherman and Hill Valley theoretically hooked up. And then I think this way over here, let's do that side as well. Now we've got it. And this bit in the middle. Yeah. And up we go. Oh, yeah, I guess you're going to have to. Do, oh, come on, that, that crossing is clearly done. Yeah, it is. Yeah, probably. Well, it'll, it'll tell me toot sweet if I haven't done it. So, uh, so that'll be, you know relatively easy to troubleshoot right i think that's probably fine and then out to pleasantville which is the longest run uh and therefore has the uh, the greatest opportunity to uh, to generate some bucks but i'm already not liking the looks of this traffic well yeah but you'll get the traffic off the road once you give them some uh, some public transportation options Will you, though? I'm not so sure you will. I think they might be quite pleased with a bit of public transportation optioning. But uh, I can't see the uh, can't see the traffic dissipating all that quickly. There we go. I think that's probably got it. Although I have high levels of uncertainty because it's not it's not bluing the uh, the entrances to these. No, I mean it's th it's there. It's done. Look, we've got wires. We've got poles. We've got track. What more do you want? All right, okay. Uh, next up, let's put in a uh, uh, a cheeky depot to make this fire. Uh, right. Now, where should I put my cheeky depot? Well, I think out here by the coast. Yeah, but that's coastal property. You, you, that's going to have a very good house price sat next. You know what? We'll stick it out here. Uh, yes, it means that some of them have got to travel a little bit to get to their first their first stop. But at the end of the day, that's that's all that's all par for the course. Right, okay, stick this out here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Right. Yeah, there you go. So this is gonna be two routes in total. You're gonna to need to electrify the street here. Which I have now done. And that. Which I have it's Look, I've done it, but stop showing red. Yeah, oh, poor. Look, it's it's not hard to you've not got any electricity on there. No, why not? Because for some reason that turned back off again. Oh, I'll turn it back on again. I have done. All right, let's get to work. Okay, right. Roots, 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 roots. Uh, new line. Uh, and we will go from Sherma Sidings uh, down to Sunnydale. Oh, nice. Uh, out to... Pleasantville, presumably, and then back to Sunnydale. Right, we can we can do a little bit more, a little bit more track work there. Oh no, no, we've we've got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's no, that's gonna be fine. Right, and that's so. Oh, naming convention time. Well, in which case we're gonna need these cities to have uh, have the right, the right slice of life kind of name. Well, this is the slice of life, so we'll call this slice. Yeah, uh, and this is going to be. Uh, uh, oh, I'm, I don't want to call it a tram. I'm going to call it a trolley bus. You know why? It's just a more fun thing to call it. Trolley bus uh, alpha. Mm. Yeah, baby. That's a, that's a thing. Uh, now, I'm going to set up the other line as well because I start paying flaming interest on my loan the second that uh, we're in motion. Right. Now, everything that I build early on should be with half an eye on, it's going to be something that continues in in some level of perpetuity. Uh, but equally, everything is is quite likely to be upgraded and uh, uh, and improved because the half the purpose of this uh, of this series is going to be uh, one part: can we make a dramatic number of passenger services run? And, uh, and one part, can we make it look good while we do so? And, and as much as I have said in the past that I, I try and make things look good, too often I try and make things look done very quickly. So, you know, let's, uh, let's take that with a pinch of salt. Right, I'm going to deploy uh, four, two on each. Right, what do we like? We know the Toronto is pretty fast. Uh, the Mirage is same speed. 
with greater capacity. I think the, I think the Mirage might be our homeboy here. Uh, the LM is just as fast, and it's uh, it's a long dog. And frankly, I don't recall having used it, so we'll we'll take that. We'll have two of those, please. Right, we'll stick those on. Oh, the first route. God, it's so easy when you don't own anything. Uh, all right, and I'll take another pair and stick them on the other one. Now, these will probably support slightly more uh, traffic than this. And also, I'd be very surprised if this made enough to offset the cost of the loan. But it's all part of the uh, of the rich adventure we find ourselves on. How am I down to two million? How much do those ruddy trams cost? Don't answer that question because I suspect it's a flipping lot. Right. Well, while they're while they're pondering themselves, I'm going to uh, I'm going to stick in. Give me that. Do you want tram track for this? No, no, I don't. Okay. All right. I just want to put in a bit of this. Extra connectivity to broaden our range. Yeah. Uh, so something about here would be quite good, but I don't want to take out that house. Yeah, well, you can't. Okay. All right. What about that corner? Make it look... Oh, dearie me. Give me the, give me the straight... There you go. Yes, that's the, that's, the, that's the ticket. That's the business right there. That won't actually have helped too much, but you never know. Uh, right then, down at Pleasantville, we see we've got uh, we've got an easy hookup can be made about there. Uh, okay, the, I see the the AI decided to do that for me. Good, nice to see we're on the same page there, computer. Uh, and then Hill Valley, which has not really got much to say for itself. Okay, so we're uh, we're coming down. We're in traffic. Let's ride a tram because we've got nothing else to do. Yeah, if this doesn't work. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to have enough money to recover from it. Um, I think uh, the original plan of... Um, oh, there is actually a tram ahead of us as well. Uh, I think the original plan of a rail line, that will definitely pay off. Uh, but we're going to have to just go go easy. Go easy to start with. Uh, I mean, that, we all know that, that, that one of the problems that, that Transport Fever 2 has is, is that once you start making a stack load of cash... You're probably you're probably about there. Uh, from that point on, unless you really screw things up, you know some traffic lights wouldn't hurt here. You know you could put those in, right? Can you? Yeah, pretty certain. All right, hang on, let's have a look. Uh, just yep. All right, thank you. Good. How do you how do you do that? That's not something I've ever really got into. Uh, hello, Emily. Yeah, nice to see you. Uh, just you, you might need this. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, um, uh, yeah, just, I was fairly certain, you're not thinking the Skylines? No, I'm fairly certain you can put in a, put in a bit of, put in a bit, of, I'm obviously just imagining it. What you can do is put in a bit of bus lane. Yeah, but that's going to cost me money. It's not on there. Okay. Yeah, in your face there, cars. Private ownership is theft. All uh, right, have some of that and a bit of this. Uh, we'll do this bit as well, and we'll see how it works out. Okay, right. I'm gonna I'm gonna whiz it by I don't know, five minutes and see where it gets us. Okay. Well, look. I mean, stuff is moving. I don't know if it's been five minutes. It might be, might have been three. Uh, let's have a look. How are you getting on there? I suspect you're empty. Yep, yeah, you're empty. Cost me eighty five G so far. Now we do have some passenger action going on. At the main tram stop, which appears to have stopped at the moment, it's not enough, not even close. But uh, it's you know something's happening. And then down here in Pleasantville, what have we got there? Five people waiting. Hill Valley. No one wants to leave Hill Valley. It's too lovely. Uh, we've this is the second new business that we've had crop up. We had a farm turn up in Utopia Planitia. Shouldn't get its hopes up. I'm unlikely to use it, but maybe I will. You never know. Um, so, what's the uh, what's the verdict? That this was a terrible idea. That's what the verdict was. Yeah, terrible idea. Terrible, terrible idea. Well, let's have a look. That's on. That's vehicles. Let's talk lines. They're costing me two hundred grand a throw. Yeah. Now, I think the passenger numbers are going to increase. The question is going to be, how many passengers am I going to need to cram onto these before they actually start paying for themselves? Uh, and it's going to be more than this. Because, don't forget, they've not only got to pay for themselves, they've, got to, they've also got to cover the uh, the bank loan as well. 
now I've got I've got one million on me uh, if I pause up here how much how much have I currently able I could borrow loads all right fine in which case we'll we'll we will in the next episode invest heavily in uh, in a bit of a train line as I outlined originally and should have done to begin with yeah I know I've been Colonel Failure, everybody. Start of a new series. We keep it brief. We keep it brisk to kick off a new series. And then eventually, the timing of these things gets completely out of hand. And uh, and they end up lasting all day. And I go, oh, I wish I didn't last all day. And you go, no, no, no. No, no. That's fine. Oh, someone wants to leave Hill Valley now. Well, I'm not surprised. It's horrible. I've been Colonel Failure. Subscribe to keep up with the series. Because the series is going to be interesting. It's experimental. That much is certain. And uh, and I don't know how well it's going to go. Uh, I'm hoping performance will uh, will remain rugged throughout, uh, but uh, you just don't know. Well, you you you'll know if you tune in. I'll catch up with you next time. Cheerio.